The goal of Canada's health charities is simple and straightforward. A healthier Canada. That's why every day we're supporting the 87% of Canadians who are likely to be affected by chronic disease or major illness in their lifetime. We are Health Partners, a collaboration of 16 of Canada's most trusted and respected health charities, representing some of the most devastating chronic diseases and serious illnesses faced by Canadians. Since 1988, our campaigns have raised over $170 million for life-saving research, services and programs. We couldn't have done it without the generous support of public servants like you. For that, we say thank you. If I had to guess, I would say probably something neurological. Embarrassingly, I can tell you very little. I honestly don't know what I think it would be. I can't imagine it would be good. Maybe related to nerve damage or something like that? I do know that it does affect the brain. Pretty much where you kind of forget how to use parts of your body, I think. I'm pretty sure it affects the entire body. That's where you lose all your muscle capacity. Um, I do remember the ice bucket challenge a couple of years ago. Alzheimer's is a disease where you forget stuff. Basically your memory starts to go. Uh, Parkinson's disease is a disease that affects the body's mobility. It's like you get the shakes, kind of. You lose control over your kind of motor function. That's insane. Because I know those three diseases that you mentioned are big on their own and I can't even imagine all three being into one. Wow. Uh, that's really unfortunate. I did not know that. That would shock me. Wow. Wow. That just sounds awful. Tragic probably would be the one that comes to mind. Devastating. <laughs> uh, devastating. Health, probably. Life changing. Terrible. It is shocking, actually. Sounds like hell on earth. It's really sad. I, I can't even imagine. It'd be terrifying. It'd be like having that, you know, kind of sort of Damocles just hanging over your head. That would change my outlook on life completely. I would be shocked. I'd be terrified. I think it, the biggest thing that, or ways we could help would be uh, in terms of awareness, letting people know what it is. Raise awareness. I mean, I would want to donate. I would want to talk about it. Um, we're all on social media these days, so just sharing information about it. Fundraising is, is what we can do. Hi, my name is Amanda. Uh, my mother suffers from Huntington's disease, and I am at 50% risk of inheriting the disease. The best thing that we can do moving forward is getting the awareness out there about it. Whether you have it or you don't, we need to talk about it and it's something that needs to be known about.